take a look at this, guys. So this is a quarter of the plate. Welcome to Bear Pantry Talk. This is the sister channel to the Bear Pantry Show. This is where you're going to find honest reviews, exciting unboxings, do-it-yourself projects, and engaging commentary. And this is my little beef. Joe's making noise over there with his plate. And remember the beef has a little bit of spaghetti sauce, but it's not a whole lot. See? See what the quarter and the quarter looks like? It's a Greenwich. Will you stop making noises over there? No. No talk. Wait, I have to move because you look dark. Go ahead. What were you saying? Why are you making all these noise when I'm trying to record? Because I'm hungry. <laughs> Tell them why we didn't go on our ride today though. Well, I never went on a ride today because of my, my valve up, my bi bicycle uh, tube is ripped off. So right at the stem? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Who ripped it off? Where's my, my where's my um, li um okay there we go my salad mighty joe young my <laughs> guys down here guys so this is my little salad that i'm really hoping nobody eats out of it but all of a sudden because i make this now everybody want to eat this i'm like leave it for me i don't want to cut up a salad every day that mean you to joe what did you say what is yours is mine what is mine is mine you had a dream Mohinga? <laughs> okay, so what I'm doing here, so you can see, I'm mixing up my my pasta with my um, meat, okay? And don't worry about this being a little bit because you get to eat another meal. I think for a while, me and Joe have only been eating one meal, right, Joe? Well, two meals, breakfast and then the lunch, right, babe? I'm not gonna put any dressing again on my salad. You know why? It's been fresh and nice, and I want, I'm trying to cut down on the calories. And I didn't lose nothing today. Matter of fact, I got on the scale and I friggin' gained. <laughs> but I know that's only like water weight, like what avocado says. <laughs> just in case, um, just in case it looks like it's a little bit off to the side, is because. I don't know how those things, you know, like Joe's desk and stuff right here is going to look when I have to drop something behind here for the green screen. But I'm here because <clears throat> I want to go into my stream yard. Well, Jada's stream yard. Let's see. I want to go into Jada's stream yard and um, put some background pictures for the green screen for when she does her little concerts. <laughs> Here I am come up with this dark shades on my thing. Oh wow, it has 307 views. Uh, keep safe, Belize. Happy Sunday family, I missed the live, was at work, a little bit busy today. Oh, Sandra, darling. I'm just reading what the people put. <clears throat> That's pretty good, Joe. My live has 20, 307 views, Joe. Mm -hmm. 307 views for my little live. 26 likes and two dislikes. Haters. Who dislikes anything? Even when a YouTuber disappoints me, I just move on. I don't dislike, you know, I, I've unfollowed two YouTubers in my life and it's because they were really out of line. I'm like, mm. Everybody was on following at the same time, so I unfollowed. Okay, so let's see. My friend Lisa sent me a batch of these. The spatula, it says the bear pantry show. The slotted spoon, see again. Can you guys see it? Let's see if this camera is gonna focus. I gotta do that? I don't know what I gotta do. The bear pantry show. The spoon. And then this kind of spatula. You know that both of these are spatulas, right? One is for egg and one is for cake. Mm -hmm, or cake batter. So grateful. I did a whole show at my cooking page on YouTube to thank Lisa. So let's see. StreamYard. Okay, I was using the wrong email.
Send me the call, Jada. So let's go into her past broadcast and open this up. And what I want to do, enter the broadcast studio as if we're going to go live. <clears throat> and then I want to enter the broadcast studio again. Why does it say Barbara there? I shouldn't say Barbara. I should say Jada. Okay, go to settings. Go to green screen. Let me show you guys what I'm doing. You guys see what I'm doing? Do it, do it, do it. Let me, let me lower you guys. See how big the screen is? So she has this picture that's built in from StreamYard. And then we put this one the other day. So we want to add more background pictures. So we want to add that one. Open. Save the background. You can't use like a straight up JPEG <clears throat> because it's too big. So we screenshotted all these pictures. Wonder if I could grab all of them at the same No, I probably can't because you have to like set them. These are pictures of England when Jada went. So when she goes live again, she can grab any of these backgrounds and use them as her background. So every day, if I'm not working for myself, I'm working for Jada. <clears throat> she needs to build out her social media if she's going to be successful in um, what that piece with her in her music. But well, you guys see what I'm doing, right? And this is my station from here. It's working from here. Hey, Joe. Can you say hi to the viewers? Hi, people. How you doing? <laughs> you look well rested. Did you sleep today? Uh -huh. A little bit. A little bit? Okay. Mm -hmm. Probably got to put some in mind too, but not tonight. I can do this anytime in mind when I go live again. It's just that I know Jada. And she's probably not going to do this. When she goes live. So, um, yeah, we went out to take our ride. And then we couldn't go because Joe's bike, the back wheel was a little bit soft. The day before, he had patched a small hole in that tire. So he's like, it's still soft. Let me put some more air in it. Then he put the little thing on the, the spike, the stem. And he pumped it up everything and then he took the thing off and it went Psss. and i know that he didn't hear that because of his hearing impairments i'm like you know that all your air just pissed out of that thing right and he's like what and so then when he checked the it, the tube is ripped right from the stem i'm like that's so hateful so we could have come back home and grabbed his old bike and he did suggest that and i told him yeah let's do that but by the time we got back he's like let me go look for the tube better and you know, he went to Walmart, they didn't have it. So we had to get it from Amazon. People want to know why everybody buy everything from Amazon. It's because you can't get it no place else. So, um, we came back. What did we do after we came back, babe? Mm -hmm. I dyed my hair. Oh, check it out. I dyed my hair. See? Blue, black. Can you guys see? So that took a little while. And I got showered. And I finished editing the video. Um, well, I had... No, we don't need this. I had already finished editing the video for the, what do you call the thing? Let me get out of this now. I don't know how to log out, you're in my way. <laughs> uh, why is my picture up there? I don't know why my picture up here. Return the dashboard, let's see. This is Jada's one. My account, log out. Okay. And I guess when I want to log into my account, it's another palabra. Which one do I use? Stream, yeah. yeah, so I dyed my hair, took a shower, uh, and then that gift came from my friend Lisa, and that was a big to-do. So then I did a live and I named it, Y'all Doing Too Much, Lisa, What Am I Gonna Do With You? And on the thumbnail picture, it's like, Stop Making Me Cry. <laughs> so I know that it's clickbait, but you know what? All the YouTubers do it. They all do it. I mean, I was watching... Um, a live event the other night 
on YouTube, right? On Nosy Ho Live. And Jaguar Wright was telling a story about how when she first met Storm Monroe, she thought he might be, I don't know if I could say that word on, on YouTube without get demonetized. I don't know. You, you got to figure it out. And she tried to set him up with a guy friend of hers. You got it, right? And then the guy says, no, I'm not. And she goes, oh, okay, I'm sorry. And that was that. And so she, you know, she's re she respects when pe what people tell them they are, who they tell them they are. And she's like, she moved on. And so she just told that story defending the guy, saying, you know, I don't like when people call him these nicknames, yada, yada, blah, 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 even though he's dragging me right now. You know, but this is what happened. Man, by the time I turn around... <coughs> Excuse you, I'm telling a story. <laughs> By the time I turn around, you know how many bloggers had a, a video posted with the headline stating Jaguar Wright said she tried to set up, you know, Storm with a man. I was like, oh my God. That's not even what she was doing. I mean, she said that, but it's not like that, you know. It's, oh my God. Child. And I don't have no beef in none of these fights, but I watch all these YouTube fights. Let me tell you why I watch the fights. Because YouTubers that are successful they will reveal and show their hands as to what they do to be successful. You guys know I've been here, well, maybe you don't know, I've been here nine years doing the cooking page. October 23rd, I started 2011. It, it'll say May if you go look in the about section or whatever, but it's not really May that I started because um, I named the channel in May, but I didn't start to upload till October. And um, I have almost 86,000 and that might seem like a lot to you, but a lot of YouTubers get to that like inside of three, four months. This is nine years that I've been doing this, can't get to 100,000. And I guess it's because I do cooking and um, I'm doing it honestly. Because honestly, some YouTubers buy subscribers. I don't play that game. My money is well spent. I'd rather use my money to buy food to do another cooking video than to buy subscribers. So, um, yeah, the, the people will do a lot of stuff and they'll succeed and they'll make money. And um, I wish that I could succeed and make money, but I, I can't buy subscribers. It is what it is. Sometimes I feel like my videos are a little bit too great of a quality because it seems like the shabbier the quality of the video, the better the video does. I don't understand this algorithm in YouTube, you know what I mean? So here I am trying today saying, y'all doing y'all doing too much, Lisa, what am I going to do with you? And the video already has 307 views. Let's refresh and see if it has more. And I did turn on my 374. You see how it's going? Because it has a shocking name. But I'm not going to always be able to do this for a cooking show. You know what I mean? My little bubble is busted, guys. I was so excited about my video getting so many views. But I went to go check on the commercial and it says it's getting limited ads due to the fact that not everything in the video was suitable for all audiences. I'm like, I don't know what in that video would not be suitable for all audiences. I didn't curse any bad words. We were having a good conversation. Nobody was saying nothing that was too, you know, um, what, so social awareness type thing. We weren't doing anything like that. Um, I don't think I said the C word for the virus that's going around. You know, Josh thinks it's my thumbnail picture because I said on the thumbnail, stop making me cry or you guys are making me cry. He thinks maybe that word is a trigger on the thumbnail. I don't know. It might be a trigger in this video too. I guess we'll know. Um, yeah, it, it's very discouraging when, you know, you put so much effort into doing a video because even though I didn't have to edit that video, you have to keep your energy up when you're doing a live event. I have to turn on the lights. I have to connect the camera the right way, go into stream. I do this, go make a thumbnail, come back, bring over the stuff that we're going to use for the green screen. That, oh my God, it's a whole thing. It takes a good 45 minutes to set up to do these live events when, you're, when I'm using the good camera and stream yard, right? Not just when I go on my phone. And then for them to just like demonetize it because limited ads in a sense is demonetized. So then this is the kicker. It says that I can go ahead and ask for a review. So I put in for the review, but I already know how this is going to go. They're going to come back and say, if I don't have a thousand views to the video, then they can't review it. It's like a catch 22. You know, they can put limited ads because they can say that the thing you know, is not suitable for all audiences. And then they'll say, uh, you know, submit it for review. Let us know that you went in there and double checked that it is okay. And then when you do that, well, you have to have a thousand views. My videos don't even get 60 views here at this page for the Vlogmas. And at the other page, it gets two, 300 views like in, you know, a week. So <sighs> that's why sometimes I get discouraged, guys. But you know what? 
I'm not going to bring your evening down or your morning, whenever you're seeing this. I'm going to be optimistic. I'm going to be grateful because like I said earlier in that video, that when you're grateful, it changes everything in your body. You start feeling physically better, spiritually, emotionally better. So I'm going to be grateful for the fact that we're all alive in this house. We're all well. Jory's COVID test was negative. Maybe I'll get demonetized for saying that. Um, what else? The dogs are healthy. We've got the mortgage for December. We even were able to pick up a little bit, well, one each Christmas gift for the kids. And um, yeah, I'm going to be grateful. I have to make a conscious effort to be grateful, right? So this is Vlogmas Day 6. I'm really grateful that you guys stopped by to watch it. I know um, some of my diehards that used to love my vlogs are like, yes, the vlogs are back. I don't know that the vlogs are going to be back at this page because I'm putting my full vlogs at my membership for five bucks. And I have a few diehards that are there and I'm so grateful for them. And the reason that I'm doing it that way, it's not even about the money because it's not like I'm making boohoo money over there. It's just for the fact that you put everything out here public. People think they know you. They make assumptions. And then, you know, you put your life at risk. So I'd rather put it privately where, you know, just a few people are there. So anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Stay safe. All right. Don't go out. We're under lockdown. We're not supposed to go out except for food, medicine and work. I believe we are able to go on the trail if it's not crowded. If the trail gets crowded, then we have to stop that. So we'll see what tomorrow brings. Joe's waiting for his um, tube to come back for his bike anyways. But if it doesn't come bright and early in the morning, because sometimes the stuff will come at 7 in the morning. If it doesn't come bright and early in the morning, he'll just use his older bike that he has. Because, you know, this is his new birthday bike. And we'll go just three miles and back, you know. So thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you tomorrow with another vlog. Bye.